Hi, welcome back. So we're back in the garden. It's a bit drizzly, uh, overcast, dull, drizzly, but a bit of drizzle isn't gonna beat anyone. So we're gonna do single stick. If you're really tight for space, drumsticks are great. You can do all the stuff that we're gonna do here with a drumstick, spatula, spoon, you know. Obviously, a stick's better. Um, if you can train out in the garden, that's the best. So we're, we're here, yeah? Um, so first thing, when you're using the stick, instead of you doing the stick like this, so get, those guys hold, hold this hard, yeah? And they hold it hard and they wanna hit you with, but basically they're hitting you with arm speed, yeah? So what you want is you don't control the stick, the stick sort of controls you. So you think of an idea in your head where you want it to go, and you let it go, and it, and you follow it, yeah, and just make sure that you arrive to together. So it's soft, it's like a whip, and you want to think of the whip starting in your back foot here. So it's not just from here; it's just not a short whip. You've got one of those big bull whips, yeah. 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 The second big thing is you want to get the angles right because we're going to do angles of attack t t t t today like five angles five fives yeah so they're really complex and they're really simple so they're 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 both as deep as you like to go so chambering so you don't want to chamber out here so they can see the, the length of the stick you want the stick tight t t t t to your head when it's here it wants to be again so it's like pointing at you like it's a a laser beam from a gun it's not always going to happen like that. Sometimes you're going to be like this, and, and they can see it. But but you want to aim at that 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 place, yeah. So you got one or two. But you want these angles to be exact. And often you get people who go one and two, and, and this angle, particularly on the backhand, is any angle, yeah. Because almost anything this side of your body, even though this is your right hand, coming from the this side. It's a bit inaccurate, and it's even worse when you're on the other hand, yeah, because it, it's, it's the other hemisphere, yeah. So, exact angle. So you want to be geometric here, yeah. Okay. So we're going to do five fives. So, uh, cincoteros, yeah. So five angles. So I'm here, just a forward stance, and again, I don't want to be square, because the accuracy drops if if you're square, because now. I'm searching for you with my arm in that bigger slot, yeah? and I'm going like this, trying to get you. So what I want is I want to almost get myself like I'm in a, a pillbox or, or I'm in an attack position. So my search range is just this much anyway. So I don't even have to think. You, it's almost pre-programmed. I can order pizza and still hit them. Yeah, I can. So I don't want extra pepperoni, and I'm still hitting that same spot all the time. Yeah, we hopefully we can give you some exercises to, to to do that. So first thing, so the first five are like reference angles. So when when people say, oh, give me an angle number one, give me an angle number two, give me an angle number three, four, and five. Yeah, so it's only five angles, but five angles is all you need. Yeah, well, I'll also show you in other episodes um, how to do other stuff as well but but for now it, this, this is so incredibly deep yeah so look we're gonna go angle one diagonal angle two diagonal angle three horizontal hitting the elbows horizontal hitting the elbows chamber yeah have your stick here and thrust in the middle so again one two three four five yeah really simple yeah one two three four five yeah one two three four five then then what you can do you want to do about 20 reps then you want to put all the weight on the end of the stick yeah which is a real hard concept to get because you can't feel it but you can after a while so you want to think like all the weights on the end yeah yeah it's just like got weight on it as if the, the end's really heavy like thor's hammer then you can put the weight down here more. So you're gonna cut with this blade, you're gonna draw it more, yeah? So same thing, but now the, the weight's in the handle. So I can play between those two. So I go light hit, light hit, heavy hit, yeah? And I can just, where I put the weight, it's a really subtle thing. So I can be doing one to five, and, and look, my angles are always the same. So if I do them to the camera, look, they're, hopefully they're, they're the same, yeah? Okay, so one, two, 
three, four, five. So you're going to go neck or collarbone because it's a cudgel. Collarbone, collarbone, or point of the shoulder. Elbow, elbow, thrust in the middle, yeah? So one, two, three, four, five, yeah? Once you've done that, then look. Go forward, they're coming back at you. Back for this. In for this, out for that, back for this. So you can just play. And we're just doing one step, aren't we? One step. So I can, I can, look, I can go one, two, three, four. Like this, five, yeah? One, two, three, four, five, yeah? Okay, it's, it's huge. So you're just playing with where you are, what's, what's happening, yeah? Once you've got it here, yeah? Then, then the thing you can do is do the next one, or we can ch change the angles on this. So you can repeat like we did uh, yesterday where you went one, yeah? All right, we can just do one, 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 then two, two, and then three, four, five. So you're not, you're not as fixed in it, right? Because otherwise it's, it's boring. You've done 20 and then you're bored. But this way, you're going hitting him, hitting him, hit, 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 stab, hit, hit, stab, hit, 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 stab. Yeah? So you can break the whole thing up. So instead of it having to go one to five, you can go one, two, three, four, five. Then look, you can go five, four, three, two, one, yeah? Okay, again, five, stab, four, three, two, one, yeah? Then you can go two, three, four, five, yeah? If you can do it only on this angle, look what you can do, you go one, two, they're charging at you, you go three, four, yeah? And then you're back on the other angle. So look, one, two, three, you moved, you've hit that person, four, five, yeah? Okay, so just playing about with what you've got, it's really simple, yeah? And then you can come back and, and, and change the angles again, yeah? So one, two, three, four, five, yeah? Then you can go two, one, four, three, yeah? Stab, so you can break up the numbers. So one to five, five to one, then just repeat any number. So you're here, you can just go one, one, two, two, yeah? So it's a framework to start from, yeah? So that's the first one, one, two, three, four, five, yeah? Next one is more combatively effective, but it's not as good for teaching. So one, through the middle, through the middle, back high, stab in the middle, yeah? So one, two, three, four, five. Again, once you've got that, put the weight in different places, yeah? So forward, back, left, right, bang, yeah? Okay, then you can do the whole thing moving as well. So one, two, three, four, five, yeah? Or you can do the triangles like we did yesterday. One, two, three, four, five, yeah? yeah? Forward triangle, one, two, three, four, five, yeah? One, two, three, four, five, yeah? So I'm doing the other numbering system. I don't do lots of this, because I did lots of this, and now I just spar with people, yeah? So it's actually, it's, it's quite hard for me to do, yeah? Because it's a construct and, it, and it's not free. So what we want you to do is learn it, then abandon it and break it up, break it up into bits, do different angles, one, two, three, four, five, yeah? Like that. So you've got different people coming at you from different angles, you're just gonna do the same things. Again, yeah, yeah. So you're just gonna play around that and basic. So two is this, one, two, three, four, five, yeah. Number three, one, two, three, four, five, yeah. Okay, so look, diagonal down, diagonal up, diagonal up, diagonal down, stab in the middle, okay. Again, one, two, three, four, five. Look, look how important the hips are in this. One, if you hit them like this, it's not gonna stop anyone. And it's not even, even with a blade, it's not gonna do anything to them. So what you wanna do is, you want this, you want one hip, hip, yeah? And you're back in, yeah? And again, then the weight is really, you can feel, you can hear it, yeah? Okay. Again, once you have that, yeah? Then, then, then you can start to play. You, you can just think about it like sparring, yeah? 
yeah? So you're going one, two, three, four, five, yeah? One, two, yeah? The other thing is, when you're here, look, you can stop this one. So if I, so if I go one, two, three, four, look, oh, please don't hit me, I'm an old guy. And as they go to come in, you smack them and, and then you're back on again, yeah? This one's really good in that if you break it down, you've got this one side of the X happening. So look, one, two, just this, yeah? Or this is even better, this. This will hit the elbow if they come to attack you, yeah? And you can smack them back. And it's really strong, and it looks, it draws them in. So again, once you know how to do it, ab 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 abandon it, yeah? One, two, so you just go, oh, thank you, yeah? Mine, 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 bub, bub, yeah? And you go, one, but mine, stab, yeah? One, two, three, four, five, yeah? And then you're back in. So you're, you're playing with it straight away. So we've got three there, three really simple ones. Have a play with them, see what you can do. One, two, three, four, five, yeah? Second one, one, two, three, four, five. Third one, one, two, three, four, five, yeah? Uh, and then be free. They just move around, think, oh yeah, that's a two, that's a one and two, so we're almost doing that thing we did. Yesterday, the forward and back, then I go one, two, oh, three and four, it's a stab there, I repeat the stab, repeat the stab, yeah? Maybe it's coming this way, I repeat the stab, now I'm back onto one again, yeah? Maybe they're coming here and I turn, no, no, but thank you. Back on the stab, one, two, three, four, five, yeah? Then I go horizontal, boom, yeah? So I'm just starting to work these into me, yeah? instead of them being a construct that I put on, they're part of me. And so I'm just thinking of targets. They're coming, I'm gonna hit the hand, hit the hand, hit the head, yeah? Body, yeah? They come to kick me, no, no, thank you. And I'm back on, so I'm just gonna play with them, yeah? So really simple to do, do them on the spot to start with, once you've done them on the spot, do them walking forward with one leg and back. Just one step to move, yeah? Don't do two, yeah? So you need to walk forward like this, yeah? Walk back, stab like that. Then if you want to add twos and threes, then you can. But do this linear thing. Once you've got the linear thing, then you can think of someone's coming here, yeah? Someone's coming from your flank now, and then you have to come back and then you've got your three and four here, or they come in here, yeah, and you're back into the, the, the five, yeah? So there's loads you can do, yeah? So first one's that one, second one's this one, yeah? Second one's through the middle and back, third one's up, down, up, down, diagonal, diagonal. Train them, get them into your, your hands, count them backwards, yeah? Count them forwards, repeat strikes, yeah? change the angle, yeah? Then improvise around it and make it you. So, and just think of an opponent and different targets, hand, elbow, head, cutting them with a blade, hitting them with a, a, a stick. So you've got different things, okay? Have a good time, s s stay well. And just like uh, the food thing now with everyone panicking, simple ingredients, there's loads you can do with it, yeah? No need to panic. Take care.